What up, what up? It's your boy Dwell, a.k.a. Mr. J. Aquí en la casa, coming at you sideways with another vlog. Hopefully you guys have been liking the videos that I do. Go check them out, like and subscribe. Support your boy Dwell. Go check out my Instagram at Dwell underscore, a.k.a. underscore, Mr. underscore J. I know it's pretty long, but go check it out. Follow me on Instagram. Go check out my music, et cetera, et cetera. Uh, I made a video the other day. I just want to say saludos. Happy Sunday real quick before I start. I'm out here barbecuing, drinking my beer. It's my Sunday routine. It's a, it's a, it's a family thing since I was a kid, you know. This is what I've been doing. But I want to make a quick video. Not, maybe, uh, not as quick, but I made a, a video in regards to Dragon Ball the other day. Talking a little bit how much I like Dragon Ball. Uh, I grew up on Dragon Ball, Dragon Ball Z, and uh, I've always had different opinions about it as I've been getting older, because I am a fan. Um, right now, right now, uh, there's no there's no anime in the works from what I know of. Um, I think there is actually some things coming up, some online stuff and stuff like that. But and and and, and then the manga, I don't really know where they're heading it. I haven't been following the. The scene too much but uh but i'm waiting for something um but it's just uh it's been a, uh, you know i saw dragon ball i saw dragon ball super when it was on youtube i would uh i would follow it then i saw it when it came out on on hulu so i saw it on hulu dragon ball super i grew up on the the dragon ball z in espanol dragon ball z dragon ball z when i was on ch channel 22 as a kid you know so i've always liked it my favorite character is vegeta i like goku i like other characters too some more than others but for some reason i like vegeta more he's my top character if i had to choose between sun like goku and, and gohan i'd choose a uh, vegeta and trunks for certain reasons but i think this video in reality lo quiero ser porque you know, i want to see my my opinion on, on, on where dragon ball is going where it's been going um where, where 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 i hope it goes because in reality the, the 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 other the the video that i made was on fan-made dragon ball and how i think for some reason from all the new stuff that's coming out because there's dragon ball heroes there's dragon ball um super that's the the latest stuff um dragon ball heroes is like a side thing but but it, it's made by by the company that makes dragon ball um i just don't know where it's going you know I, and I, that i haven't been following or looking at it, it's just like way out there in my opinion dragon's ball super was cool in my opinion i liked it but i don't know man in my opinion like the art the art was kind of lame in, in, as a whole series there were some episodes that were cool the art was cool but in general como que no le echaron ganas en dragon ball super some stuff I like, but I think they go way overboard in powers now, like way overboard. And 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 in reality, why I wanted to make this video was because of. I also saw a thing right now on YouTube, like a poll: What's your favorite uh, uh Super Saiyan from Goku? What's your What's your favorite transformation? And it had a Super Saiyan, it had a Super Saiyan God, the the red one. It had Super Saiyan Blue, and it had Ultra Instinct. And I went for. For Super Saiyan, for Super Saiyan, uh, the re the original one. Um, not that I don't like the other ones, but I just think they're going too far. Like, what would be next after that? And in reality, a lot of the stuff ain't really Saiyan transformations. I guess you could say the the blue and the and the red are Saiyan transformations. But, uh, and they're cool but I, I, it's not like not it's not an original original super saiyan and where i don't like where they went to 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 on that level it's like goku and vegeta with respects they can reach that level they work their ass off to reach that level and and then it's just all of a sudden gohan reaches that level to match their strength all of a sudden um What's his name? Um, Android 17 reaches that level. It's like, what? How can, 
how can uh how did they reach those levels you know it, it trips me out you know i guess like gyron or jiren whatever you call them they're from other planets we don't know their stories but they reach those levels i'm talking about the characters that we know it's like how how is it possible that, that they reach those levels you know that's where it where, where it gets me off like dragon like broly like like i really like the movie dragon ball super broly i really liked all those movies from the modern stuff that came out like dragon ball uh, resurrection f dragon ball battle of the gods um dragon ball broly and the new one i really liked it um but it's like gohan did i guess gohan didn't really train but and all of a sudden he's stronger than goku and vegeta you know all of a sudden piccolo well piccolo trains you know but 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 his and his transformations like like beast i don't get i don't get the beast thing like so pretty much goku can do that and vegeta too and trunks and and goten can they do that and pan you know or is it only gohan because if gohan can do it then 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 trunks can do it because they're all half too if it's just a half team then is that a human it's still saying thing you know because humans can't transform like that that's where i don't get where they get these ideas from that's my only my only opinion that's why i i like the original stuff better sometimes i even like the concept of gt better than super because at the end super saiyan 4 was was um uh still a saiyan thing you know a saiyan thing they didn't go beyond that as gods and like how is goku and Vegeta? that's i like it cool but it's like how how can they how can they be gods you know and beat gods you know they train and all of a sudden they're gods like that's where i i i, I don't get it and all of a sudden everybody is as strong as a god like goku got and vegeta got super saiyan blue and all of a sudden pretty much now they can go at it with the gods even android 17 you know frieza gohan like everybody has the power of a god like i don't get it you know that's just my opinion on 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 that like for some reason dragon ball uh, gt a lot of people didn't like it didn't um from, from from what i see online um i wasn't the biggest fan of it but i didn't hate it at all to some extent i think it was cool they kept it at a, at a level like the dragons battling the dragons um those were still good concepts to to think of in dragon ball super the, the only one that i really liked the, the the saga that i really liked so far um because they did a pretty much frieza they also they made the movie frieza and they repeated it in dragon ball super the, the anime series they did battle the gods the movie just so they could also ruin that like they did the frieza saga in the anime you know the movies were good enough and they ruined those two sagas by by copying them and still changing up the stories and different stuff and exaggerating them more that's just my my, my theory that's where I, I don't like where they where they went with that you know the dragon ball super broly we don't know how they're going to incorporate it to the animation i guess uh, from my understanding that's it's canon but it's in its own separate storyline just like uh dragon ball super superhero don't get me wrong those movies were good i like the movies it's just i think gt kept it a little bit more original to where where, where it's still like about the saiyan legacy saiyan blood like all of a sudden kefla and dragon ball super you know they they can match a dragon uh, a god too you know like everybody can match all of a sudden a god level like they, they there's no respect in the power levels and and that's why i like uh, i never really saw i seen clips and stuff like that but i never really seen the dragon ball the series the original first series created by kira toriyama but dragon ball z i think they did a hundred percent akira toriyama did a hundred percent on that in in the style and the storyline in the in the art and all the little side stories side they did a real good job on that he did a real good job on that and dragon ball super i think like i said it, i don't know man i don't know i know like i said in dragon ball super the one that i really respected the most and i liked the most was dragon ball the saga of trunks when, when he faces goku black because it was an actual side creation like like i said it wasn't copied it was original still 
and the, the tournament of power was just like overscaled in my opinion there was good scenes there really was but i think it's just like i said overscaled over exaggerated over over everything you know and i think that's where where dragon ball is going and, and i wouldn't want to see them ruin it and in my opinion that's why i say the the the, the fan animations are for some reason are doing better than the actual content the actual storyline the actual animation the actual drawing style the actual stories they're doing way better than they are in the real series for some reason i think dragon ball super kind of went too much um like trying to base it like pokemon type style um idea you know like for kids but i don't think the kids are really gonna grow from that like the kids that saw dragon ball z did they're not gonna have those, those memories but yeah continue this later